Now, back in 1942, able seaman Colin Grazier paid the ultimate sacrifice with an act of bravery that's credited with changing the course of World War II. The 22-year-old from Tamworth drowned after recovering crucial Enigma code books from a sinking German U-boat. Now, to mark the 70th anniversary of his death, actors at an open-air performance will pay tribute to him. Joan Cummins has the story. Is it a love poem? Well, it sort of is. It, 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 it's more about our future and what we'll do once this war is over. In a park in Tamworth, actors recreate the story of a local man whose selfless heroics are credited with enabling the Bletchley Park code breakers to crack the Enigma codes. He'd been married for two days before he went off to sea and he never returned and he could have stayed on the ship and not gone and tried to uh, salvage the Enigma codes, but he didn't, he chose to do his duty. If that lurking U-boat is anywhere near the pressure created by the exploding charges, it can be crushed like an empty eggshell. Abel Seaman Grazier died retrieving the code books on the 30th of October 1942 from a sinking U-boat. Seventy years later, an audience will be led through the streets of his hometown by actors who are commemorating his life and his sacrifice. We're painting a really true historical picture that uh, Colin Grazier, along with his colleagues Fasson and Brown, were instrumental in, in discovering the Enigma Code that was uh, there to reduce the Second World War. Battle stations! Battle stations! Although Colin and his colleagues were awarded the George Cross posthumously, the need for secrecy has denied generations the knowledge of their role in the Allied victory. Phil Shanahan has documented the importance of the true Enigma heroes and is campaigning for a memorial to the men at the National Memorial Arboretum. Well, without these men, there may never have been a D-Day in June 1944. The war might have gone on for another year, and possibly as long as another two years, and that would have cost countless more lives. So you can't just explain their importance in terms of Britain. They were hugely important to the free world in general, because they paved the way for peace. Images of Colin Grazier's war will be projected onto buildings during the one-off performance on the 30th, in a town that's determined to remember and honour all their heroes. Joan Cummings, BBC Midlands, today, Tamworth. Fascinating. Now let's have a look at the weather. Here's your...